my thoughts because you know what if I'm wrong what if I come off silly you know um, just some, some issue I have to work on um, but I think I've actually ma made my point there and said it right I think they handled the Chogo thing poorly there was build up to him and then for most players he disappeared uh, from the story and you know that is really weird and I don't know what was going through Blizzard's head when they made that course of action. Well, I can certainly see pros too having an exclusive thing and a cool boss fight for Mythic di difficulty. I'm not sure if that's the way to go about it. Well, it's cool to have Chogo swoop in and be the true boss fight. Well, not the true boss fight, but have two two bosses as, you know, one one thing. Two bosses, one cop. <sighs> I have two minds of it, and personally I think the cons outweigh the pros. It could be kind of a cool thing, but at the same time, you know, it ends, for most players, it will just leave a hole in the story. And, to, though, to be honest, I kind of forgot he existed. So, I didn't, it didn't really bother me too much. But, I'm just, just think, looking back on it, and it does seem a little flimsy. Uh, so, yeah, I think I made my point well enough. If you, if there's anything you'd like to say, let me know. If you want me to rephrase something, you know, let me know. That, well, you know, and that holds true for anything. I might think I'm making sense, but in reality, I'm just here sitting, saying brrrr the entire time. You know, for all I know, we've done it. Chogo himself has been utterly humiliated by you. <laughs> I'm just rolling my tongue at every opportunity. His minions are dread, uh, and the Gordok are scattered. And now all will know the might of the Horde. Uh, Loktar Durkar. You've more than earned your reward. You've done a hell of a job here, Durkar. With the Twilight Hammer shamed, and the Gordani left bleeding and broken, we'll be able to set our sights on the true battle with the Alliance here. It'll take time to build our forces enough to match the Night Elves infesting this place. I'll send you ahead to Camp Moache, to the east. They've got problems of their own. We can't let any horde territory fall here. Loktar. She actually does have her own quest. Another an, another quest for for me. Don't know what it is though. Oh, you fucking trollop! I lose eight agility. No. I think I'm about to get to exalted with Ogremar. Nice. So, what's this quest? The Darkness Legacy, Ancient Suffering, Verninius, the Twisted, Return to Sage, Pale Walker. The Battle Plans. Uh, and she's back there. Spoilers. Okay. I'm gonna head over here. And actually, Thousand Needles is next. And I'm already near leveled it for them. <sighs> That's just going to be a constant bitch from mine. Because I don't like being out. I don't like out leveling zones before I enter them. Because it doesn't feel right, you know? Verdanis River. Um, Verdanis uh, River, maybe? I'm not sure. It just doesn't feel right being so out leveled, but. Oh yes, you've finally discovered Feralis. Well done. Well done, dear car. Brightest man of your generation. But, um... You know what? What you gonna do, eh? They've sped up leveling to help you get through to the more recent content. But... Which means you out... You end up faster leveling what you're already in. And if you're doing what I'm doing, I have to do every quest in the zone. It ends up... and Ends up going awkward. Oh, There's Nulls here. Cool. Um, ultimately, it's not a big deal. It's just a preferential thing by, on my part. Um, eventually, I'm sure it'll work itself out when I, you know, get to Legion territory. And by Legion territory, I mean max level. When, you know, once I'm, you know, max level and, you know, broken shore, I'm, I'm sure I'll be at level event, you know, then. And, you know, all oh, hunky dory. Mine! 
Thank you. I clearly did all the work there. You lazy fex. Oh. Probably should be, uh... The snow temple? That's concerning. It's randomly going pink. Incredible power can be found in spirits or music of the animals that we battle against. Look inside yourself. Learn to harness the power of your own spirit, and you will be more powerful than you ever imagined. Tell me more about music. Uh, existing in this area, many creatures considered allies of the night elves. The, night, uh, the elves have had access to the power within each of these creatures. It's time that the horde be allowed this same satisfaction. Advise the way that this power can be captured and used for our benefit. Do not doubt what I tell you, Durkar. Help me, and you shall see that I speak truth. See ya later. I sense something familiar in your presence. Well done indeed. I'm expecting nothing less than, my, uh, than for my own daughter. She'll make a fine witch doctor someday. The wandering forest walkers that can be found meandering through the, for, uh, through the forest are our next target, Durkar. Night elves have enlisted trans. Uh, we start again. The, f the wandering forest walkers that can be found meandering through the forest are our next target, Durkar. Night elves have enlisted trans as allies to fight against uh, the horde. Their movement may be slow, but their role as protectors is undeniable. Soon we'll be able to, to use this power for our own benefit. Find three wandering forest workers, w walkers. Kill them and use the music vessel to shrink and capture them. Krug Skull Splitter. Okay. What brings you Greetings, Surkar. I'm thankful we've come, Shaman. Our camp is beset by many perils, and yet we must tend to those fleeing the devastation of the cataclysm. If there is to be any refuge here, you must help us. Twisted sisters. I've heard of your battle against the corrupted dragons, Durkar, and I thank you for your courage. But I have disturbing news. The dryads at forced, though allies at night elves have always passed us by in peace. But they have become cruel and twisted, attacking any who wander the eastern walls. I fear for the safety of the refugees here, Durkar. Please, put a stop to these twisted dryads. That's a reference to a band. Uh, it's, you know, I know that much. I have listened to the band. I am proud of Maachi's reputation as a safe haven in the walls of Feralis, but the camp faces many threats. The Gordani ogres gather nearby in the northern foothills, claiming their territory and despoiling their wildlife. With the arrival of brothers and sisters seeking shelter, can I cannot cannot let them linger any more. Go north and drive the ogres out. We're staging a relief effort at a West Reach Summit for all Tav Thousand Needles. Shane will lead you. Uh, will lend you my windrider to safely get to get you there. Speak with cannot uh, can't he gray cloud when you land. Must go quickly if I was to be saved. No. Uh, Chief Spirithorn, I beseech you to send aid to Westreach Summit now before it is too late. I've sent all the warriors I can. Had I but even one more for you. I'll do that eventually. That's to send me to Thousand Needles, but I'm not ready to go yet. Well. I have been beset by visions, Shaman. Visions of an icon of great power falling into sinister hands. I see an amulet held by the ancient elves, sitting forgotten, while its surroundings turn to roots, until it is captured by demons through trickery and malice. Each night these sights flow through my dreams. The spirits are warning us. I am too old. The camp's braves too occupied with, guard but with guarding us. Must beseech you to follow my visions to the south, to tr darkness runes, and seek out the amulet. Interesting little target dummies. Hadoken Swift Strider. Hadoken, really? Huh. Oh, so you got a floating shield. We must ensure the survival of this camp at all costs, Shaman. Our enemies must not be given any quarter, for they will surely give us none were we to need it. The Gnolls, they are more than a nuisance. They are a constant threat to the existence of this very camp. It is irrelevant uh, whether they are indigenous to Frowls or not. We do not strengthen our resolve if we do not strengthen our resolve against them, we we'll find ourselves driven out of the entire region. The Gnoll attacks against the camp have become fevered as of late. So we need your aid in obtaining their numbers. Bring me ten of their mains and reward you handsomely for your efforts. 
go. Uh, just uh, just inside the eastern wing of Darmal, one of the Warpwood ancients, Fergus Warpwood, lives on the, uh, still lives uncorrupted. I must travel there and help them drive out the corrupt, terrible creatures that have taken it as their own, for they set their sights on Campoache. Perhaps we can even enlist his aid afterwards, ensure we maintain our presence in Frawless, with, our, with enemies on so many sides. I'll take it, but I won't be doing it yet. The Highborn. Esturlin, a powerful and uncorrupted Highborn, has managed to enter the western wing of Adarmal. Uh, ah, yeah, uh, that's what the, uh, that, that faction. The Shendra, 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 oh, I can't remember what they're called. I mentioned their name earlier. Uh, that they've joined the uh, Night Elves. They, they were highborn. Uh, regardless of your personal convictions of his kind, I, I, it, uh, it is an effort to, uh, and has asked for assistance in cleansing it. Regardless of your personal convictions of his kind, it is an effort that I must support for, uh, for our own good. Please hurry. We need every foothold and for that we can get. You will find our mall to the west. In fact, his assistants are actually hostile to you. It's funny that you can talk with him and... You know, he won't kill you. Blaze Montgomery. Or Blaze Montgomery. Ooh. Greetings once again. I just wanted to send you word that things here in Camp Moache are going well. Oh, he's in Moache? Or is that a, a mistake? Because he was in the other camp. I've managed to make several piece, new pieces of letter items. Thanks in no small to your aid. This was no, it thanks in no small part to your aid. I had some extra bits of leather le left over, so I thought I'd send you something extra as a way of saying thank you once more. If you ever visit, if you're ever by the camp again, be sure to visit. Peace to you and your ancestors. Jan Dor. Won't be using that. Put that away. Well, I'm curious. Can you find them here? No, that's not him. No, it doesn't seem like he is here. Like the refugees. It's all in runes. It's all in runes. May the art mother preserve us. You have to go to Thousand Needles and help. Please. Later. When I finish this zone. Uh. Okay, we will swing this way first. Actually, uh, I don't know which ones to deal with. Okay, we'll start here, here, then we'll go down here. They can handle the ones here in the camp. Uh, like, I could just stay, wait here and try and pick off the ones that enter, but can't be bothered. This just increases armor by four, uh, but can't be used on items higher than item level 600. So it could be used up to, like, Cataclysm t level, I think. Corrupted Earth Shield. My attacks heal to the shielded target. Uh, they're speaking in their Nassim. Their Nassim. <laughs> that ass. Stop running away, you whore. There we go. Um, dryads, I remember, you get to have them in Warcraft 3 as a unit. They have a poison on their staff, on their spear. That's, I think, kind of useful, but I don't really remember. Um, I don't remember what it does. But I, mem I remember it take liking it, thinking it was actually quite a very useful thing. Um, I just wish I remembered more, more about it. I think it slowed enemies, much like that one does there. But uh, I can't really comment on it. Ooh, excuse me.
Um, I remember having them in quite a f quite large numbers as well. Cause again, I, I like drats. Um, I actually, if I remember, they were also magic immune. I'm not. Again, that's a uh, useful enough benefit, depending on what you're going up against. If you're just going up against random, you know, grunts or footmen or ghouls. It's not really too interesting. But if you're going up against, uh, you know, beings with actual magic, then it's, you know, actually useful. You know, shockingly. The Laris Pavilion. I remember. I think you can exit High Mall over there. There is him. Z Rash Fireblade. And. Ah, there's Az Torin, House of Shendralar. Yes, that's the faction I forgot. I think I said it a moment ago, but dismissed it as wrong, because it sounded wrong. Yeah, Shenduar. But, um... What was I trying? Oh yeah, I was talking about Dryads in Warcraft 3. Yeah, I found them a useful unit. I don't remember it all together too well, um... But I remember they had some poison thing on their spears that I thought was useful. And I remember... Um... Hold on. Um... I remember they were magic immune. Um, remember, I will make quite a few of them. Though I'm not sure, Parma is wondering how good of a unit they were actually were. It just since I don't remember what their you know their stats were like, I can't really comment. I just remember I I, I liked using them, I because I thought they were good. But um, I really don't remember. I think the I think the poison did slow enemy movements. It might have also done a bit of damage. But uh slowing enemies was always a useful thing. I'll deal with the gnolls momentarily when I'm down here. Because then I can multitask and get to the uh war plants as well. Hopefully I was coherent there. Hopefully. <laughs> Sorry. We are able to capture the wandering forest workers. Thank you, Durkar. This is my first time walking with Trent Musek. Durkar, next I must have you capture a creature that in appearance may look quite fragile, but yet its powerful spirit is what we are truly after. Fairy dragons that I speak of, uh, the fairy dragons that I speak of serve the night elves as their allies. We must capture one so that the horde may benefit from the strength of spirit as well. Here is Musek, Durkar. Kill eight spirit darters or spirit strike dragons and capture their music. Uh, they may be found to the west of here. Okay. I'll head out. Wait, what's around else? Oh, yeah, there was one other one to turn in. And there's another one here. This guy, it's Ghost Putter, that's one for me. Well met, Shaman. I've traveled with my companions down to Frolis on a mission for our Ogremar masters. My wife, my Corn, finds great pleasure in new clothing, so I aim to make her a new cloak adorned with gossamer wings of fairy dragons. Would you be able to help me? Sprite dragons with the gorgeous wings I want are west of Camp Moache. Um, I thank you, Durkar, but the tale of your hunt troubles me. There should not be so many. The sickness is still spreading. You saw in this call. The dragons of nature, heed your call, Drukar. Do not linger here. A request for your aid is both a great honor and an omen of terrible danger. See, this place she spoke of is called the Emerald Summit. A path off the main road through the lower wilds leads up one of the high, uh, high stone uh, leads up one of the high stone plateaus. You'll find a small shrine at the top. May all frolics may rest upon your shoulders. May the Earth Mother watch over you. Be careful. I thank you, Durkar, but there's more work to be done to keep the camp safe. Listen further. Sasquatch sightings. Sasquatch, um, more in the Warcraft 3. If you wandered to the right place, by hidden behind trees during the for, like uh, second undead mission, you would find a secret Sasquatch meeting.